The Advanced Naval Technology Exercise Innovation and Sensor Fusion Experimentation Event was hosted by the Naval Surface Warfare Center Crane Division with the Indiana National Guard on August 28th through September 1st, 2017. The Antec Sensor Fusion Event focused on the integration and interoperability of sensors and weapon systems, provided an environment for participants from government, academia, and industry to collaborate and test emerging technologies designed to enhance the capabilities of the warfighter. The week-long event, covering three locations, included live fire demonstrations at Camp Atterbury on Monday, integrated system of systems non-kinetic testing, at Muscatatuck Urban Training Center on Tuesday, a technical interchange meeting at NSWC Crane on Wednesday, standalone industry demonstrations at Muscatatuck Urban Training Center on Thursday, and live fire kinetic integrated system of systems testing at Camp Atterbury on Friday. On Tuesday, August 29th, observers gathered in the theater at Muscatatuck Urban Training Center to see the various systems' ability to detect, identify, track, and negate threats on the big screen. And yes, popcorn was served. After the viewing, attendees spoke with subject matter experts about the various technologies that were demonstrated. During this time, I had the opportunity to ask some of our subject matter experts and distinguished visitors about the event. The benefits are really the collaboration between all of the different innovation cells, the industry that's developing a lot of these technologies, but more importantly the engineers and the scientists at Crane that are actually testing these out to be able to see how we can implement them into our CONOPS and our daily uh, tactics and procedures for the warfighter. Being able to uh, rapidly test uh, upcoming uh, requirements and needs from the fleet um, and not bearing the full burden of cost that it would take to set up a test event primarily just for ourselves. Uh, piggybacking with other systems and programs allows us to see where we're deficient, where they're deficient, where they're strong, and they can see where we're strong as well and share and collaborate on ideas to improve those deficiencies. It allowed, uh, I think, a lot of folks come together from different backgrounds and diverse uh, functions provide us an opportunity to discuss and see what new technology coming on coming down as well as seeing things actually demonstrated in the field. Uh, many times you can see things in a PowerPoint presentation, you can read a book, a book or a brochure on it, but when you get a chance to actually see in the field what it does, that gives you the better perspective and know what its limitations or what its potential is. Uh, it's always good to see the integration of these systems. I think the benefits really end up uh, uh, happening for the warfighter who we get a chance to, to fuse these systems together and, and really push the envelope on what's the art of the possible with some of this technology. So uh, very pleased with how the event went. I was pleased with uh, the success of the scenarios and the demonstrations. And uh, I think the third benefit of this is that you get a chance to, to see some collaboration between entities that's important uh, for us going forward. And that doesn't always happen naturally. And so this brings those folks together and really fosters that innovation and integration. So it's a good thing on all fronts. On behalf of NSWC Crane, thank you for making this year's Advanced Naval Technology Exercise a success and have a great Navy day.